Hello, YouTube. I know I've been slacking lately, but, you know, if not one, then there's another thing. Uh, there's a show coming up this weekend in Tampa, so I was getting ready for it. There's uh, problems here, problems there, but, you know, we'll survive. Uh, let's go see what's blooming. So, as you can see, I still didn't fix it. It was really hot, number one. And number two, every day we have a really serious storms coming uh, through. So this job will require the whole day. I think right after my show this weekend in Tampa in USF Botanical Garden, if you guys are in the area, stop by. It will be a smaller kind of show, but that makes it very, like, personal. You know, we can chat. There will be, um, Brethren will be there, and uh, Miranda, Accent, a good people. And I was totally convinced that nothing is blooming, and th this morning I went and checked, and look at this. We definitely will need um, spray here. This is going to be really, really nice. This is the one from sun coast of course they sell on facebook on the sun coast uh, sales page this one was gifted to me by them and this is it's just mind-blowing uh, this plant is in full bloom somewhere in my videos if you will go into the sun coast videos of mine then there's this little orphan of the storm. Got a boyfriend or girlfriend there. And then, you know, when I was in this mess, I noticed this happening. Now, this is so good. And I don't see a name on it. But this is going to be something very, very yummy. As you can see, so fatty. Isn't that cool? Yeah, and it's basically in the full sun here, so maybe that's what I needed for them. Kind of a little bit of a stress situation. I don't want to even show it. It's embarrassing how they all look. Then I went this way. Take a look at all these ladies. This greenhouse is in a better shape. Uh, and I thought nothing is happening here. But then... As I was walking by, I noticed something right here. How cool is that? This is also... Today, I don't know why, the, all the Sun Coast gifts are blooming. Also, a wonderful, beautiful gift from Sun Coast. Look at that girl. Isn't she something? Very fragrant. And there's one more coming out is that it yeah, very nice roots you know this is what happens sometimes you just give them space what we human call and they start performing better now this I recently moved to a much more serious light because uh, it's one of the Volkerianas a very beautiful kind i unfortunately lost the tag but it's more of a like a cerulea colored uh from spring water ton so uh she looks very very good but we'll see what happens so what's here here's a surprise and the surprise that is just doesn't want to hang the way i want it to hang it keeps moving this never bloomed for me ever so here is her name and only after she was kind of abandoned by me and i stopped you know loving her motherly loving her she started performing so you know sometimes that's the remedy you have a stubborn plant and it doesn't want to do what it's supposed to do you just do that. You let them grow on their own. Now, what's here? 
Yeah, one of the reasons why I haven't done yet much, there's always something, you know, there's always something and we kind of have our priorities, so kids and the families first, you know, making money, supporting the what my children needs is number one, Nothing's happen nothing's happening here. Uh, well, for example, today we have a dog that needs to go to the vet in the emergency very like private matter all of a sudden if you guys have dogs you know it's really common problem impacted anal glands to the point that he really really needs to see a doctor it's not pretty um it's charlie that's the one that is um white and brown the blenum yeah and he's a sweet boy he is not being you know pain for me he's a real man but still it's so hard to see them in pain and again you know oh look you had a bloom and then the thrips suckers i need to get my spray this was a little thing that i attached at kevin's yeah so i think you know the way your plants look <laughs> reflects your situation. So I'm all over the place. I, by the way, wanted to see this one was up, up front. Look how much difference it made. I brought it here. This is a Nobelor, Kathleen Nobelor. I want a better light and I cannot find it. And I was really struggling up front. And then I brought her here and look, within a couple of weeks, we got one, two, three new growth and one is right there that's cool like that and i try to give them different you know options of light and oh you're blooming again oh they need the spray bad i sprayed the front now i need to you're still blooming oh yeah this girl is amazing does that march putin she had really, really nice couple of clusters. Um, and I think I showed you. And now we have one here and possibly two right there. So yeah, one by one, day by day, we're going to get through this. And one day this is going to get fixed. <laughs> you know, and we'll be good. This is my... That bamboo orchid, if you remember when I was at OFE, I got it. It bloomed. Oh, the seeds opened. Yeah. These, I don't know. These kind of ground orchids, so who knows? Maybe I'll have some. There's some dendrobiums here. Just the regular little dendrobiums, Mr. Chang. He's working on his next bloom. What's going on in there? I brought a load of orchids from the front over here because they were not doing well up front. So this little cart is still sitting here in my way. I don't think... Oh, well. When I say I don't think it happens right here. I don't think it's happening. And you know what amazes me in these situations when you have a crisis, yeah? The doctors. Don't get me on, start me on that subject because I've been through lots of things with doctors. A couple of years ago, my ex-husband was sick and he was very serious. Oh, look. That's that. I don't even know because that never bloomed for me. And here we are. Yeah, so the doctors can be different. That's why I'm not a big doctor fan, <laughs> generally speaking. Oh, there's a cute little thing over there. So I'm calling the vet's office this morning 
and I'm telling them that there is a big emergency. And of course there was this, uh, whoever she is, receptionist. Well, she didn't really seem to care how big of a emergency that is because she is a busy lady, okay? And she offered me nine o'clock this next morning, which in this situation is not an option because you know, he's in pain and it was progressing real quick. I saw him in the morning. Look at these guys are blooming. They are so beautiful. And I kind of had another option to take him to the emergency. But the emergency again opens only at 5 p.m. here locally. So, and that would cost probably my mortgage payment. But anyhow, uh, I called later my doctor's office and apparently there was another lady who was very nice and compassionate and she was really interested in helping me look at these guys aren't they cool so bright she told me that there was another option that i can come in as an emergency patient and just sit and wait which i could have done at 11 this morning and now we're going at 2 30 you know so yeah very sad that the doctor's field well any field, field you know i had different kind of businesses and i see that professionals can be really not what they supposed to be but anyhow that's a little crying out loud for you it's a little pretty dendrobium for you yeah, and I have a show tomorrow, so well, set up tomorrow. By the way, if you guys are coming, my mom will be helping me. So if you guys going to be coming, you'll have a pleasure to meeting my mom. She all of a sudden <laughs> volunteered, uh, probably even for Saturday as well. But we'll see how that will go. So, so far, I think this is all that blooms. Some couple of nice surprises there for now the weather is fine but you can see over there it's been really really wet see this grass it grew in the last like five days see how tall yeah so wish me luck with my charlie we're gonna go and fix the boy and i will talk to you for sure in the next couple of days because of that show let me find something pretty, like this dendrobium right here. Been blooming for me for a while. That is Jacqueline something. There. Uh, yeah, and that's fragrant. Very pretty. Okay, so until the next time, you have a great day. And we're going to the vet.